Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to Minecraft. It's Sticks here. We are flying down at the main street of Victoria and that sun seems to be setting very quickly. So we should get this intro done nice and quickly. Today guys, I think I want to build some more buildings in Victoria here, the Victorian city. And uh, yeah, hopefully we can do that. I'm thinking here. So this mountain needs to be taken out. This portal needs to be put in a building. That would be helpful instead of just out in the middle of nowhere. And yeah, so what I'm thinking, guys, is this main street is meant to have shops on it because it is the main street. So that would be very helpful. Um, yeah, so we have the, these buildings here. This this is just an apartment building. There's no shops on it. So these ones here and all the ones that go there and over there, I think I need to put shops on the bottom level there. So that'd be cool. Um, I'm going to go look for some ideas, get some inspiration from Googling things. And uh, also there's like a Victorian Minecraft world that I like to look around. But um, yeah, that'll give me some ideas. I'm going to take all of this acacia down because that's not for decoration, guys. That's just because I need acacia wood. And yeah, farming it is uh, quite difficult. So it's it's in the way if we want to build buildings here. I think I'm going to do it over there, but I think it's high time I cut all these down. And I'll store the saplings somewhere because uh, yeah, they're quite difficult to get all of the saplings and wood from these things. Okay, anyway, enough rambling, guys. Let's get some buildings done um, on this main street, hopefully. I'll come back with sort of... Um, an idea, a palette, and uh, yeah, we'll 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 uh, crack on with that. Well, guys, all of these trees are cleared now. We got most of the saplings. There's a few up there, but uh, we got five, almost five stacks of saplings, and we almost got eighteen stacks. Well, I suppose we got seventeen and seven stacks of acacia log. That's oh, oh, there's another seven on me. Well, yeah, that's fantastic, guys. We cut all that down. Okay, it's it's night time again. Let's get working on these buildings. Well, guys, of course, I decided I wanted to use a block that I don't have much of. So here we are at the farm. I'm going to have to wait here a bit. I think I'll just wait to get a couple of stacks. I'm not sure. I just want to make dark prism. Yeah, we need eight stacks to make one stack. Okay, um, I've got I've got four stacks of die. So I'm just going to wait here a bit. This does fill up reasonably quick while you're here. So, I mean, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Um, it's not the best. I haven't actually fixed this thing fully. It's a little bit broken. It kind of fries some of the fish at the top. But apart from that, guys, it's working fantastically. So let's just wait here for all of these freaks to die, and then we'll have some Dark Prismarine that we can use. Alrighty, guys, I got a bunch of materials here. We got a bunch of bricks I just traded for all these. We got the Acacia from just before. We got some Nether Bricks. I only got one stack of Dark Prismarine now. I got the rest of these here. Uh, right, some Quartz is what I want to actually replace this corner with. For now, let's place that in and run over here. And I think we're going to go Quartz. It might put pillars on the side, I'm not sure. Uh, so, actually, speaking of which, there's some more quartz in here. Let's get all of that out now. Let's put our stone cutter down. The greatest block ever. And let's just get um, some of these. I don't really like these, but they might look alright out here. Yeah, okay, they look alright out here. I don't like them on certain builds, but let's just chuck them in here, guys. Put in... Uh, actually, let's put four. Put one more on this side to give us the right height there. Okay, so all we need to do now is have some sort of doorway, like maybe over here. So we have a doorway that walks in there, and then we can have... Um, right, so we want probably one block back from that. I'm not too sure. I'm just trying to work this out, guys. So if we bring up the quartz like that and have a nice doorway about that size, um, it's only going to be too high, isn't it? So we have that. And then we could put another one of these in. Um, actually, no, I don't think we do want to do that. I think we want to leave it open. And then, this is what I got the Dark Prismarine for. Uh, I don't think we need to do that many. My inventory is full already, guys. I just started. I literally just started. This is unreal. Right, you go there. Empty, empty some of this stuff out. I suppose I did bring quite a lot of stuff over. Um, right, stone cutter. Don't need that many. Only need about that many for now. So this is what I brought the Dark Prismarine for. I think I want to make like a little veranda coming down. Um, like this. And if we just bring that... Oh, actually. I think maybe just like that will do. That along like this. So let's just try that. We'll have some windows here. Probably about that height, actually. So if we bring that along to there. Bring that down. And then have the shop window like that. I think that'll look pretty cool. Yeah, and then we can just bring this along. Let's just place everything. Oh, no. These blocks are precious. I need to go and collect every single one. I can't let any of them float away, guys. Any of them time out. Okay, let's bring that across to there. 
And then I think if we bring this along, this will make it look like a shop front. And then have obviously the path going into it. And if we take all these out and make this part of like the sidewalk bit as well. Now I'm just wary that the uh, park is right there. So is this... Oh yeah, that's enough space to make a shop come back, isn't it? Yeah, okay, cool. Now, it, what is that looking like, guys? Is that looking like a shop? Yeah, that's looking like a nice shop. Cool, 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 cool. Um, now, above this, I think what we'll do... Um, okay, this windows... Those windows look a bit big. Maybe break it up like that, have a three and a two. Yeah, I think that'll look cool. All right, I don't know what kind of shop this is. Maybe this could be a fancy a fancy dress shop. This could be a clothes shop because it looks quite like uh, nice and things. And then over here, we could have some wood. Uh, let's get the acacia wood for the next shop along. Obviously, these buildings are going to go up a bit. I'll build that in a second. But I think if we have like maybe this as the next shop, like coming out at this this far out. Because we, we want them to be all different, you know. And yeah, that could be the next shop there. And that could be like a, a fruit and veg shop or something like that. I'm not too sure. Just figuring it out. This is the main street. So maybe not fruit and veg. Maybe a restaurant or something. I don't know. But as for this, this is what that's looking like. Okay, that's cool. Let me just build a little, the next level. And let's see if these colors are working together and stuff. Because I'm still not sure yet. Yep, okay, that's working. I like the colors together. The brick looks nice with this and with the white. Okay, that's very cool. That gives it a bit of difference. Uh, we can put some of those other things in there. What are they called? Other blocks of quartz. They are called chiseled stone quartz. Let's get four of those. Just to see what that looks like. I need to come around and pick up these few pieces that fell off. That is annoying. Um, I think that's all the pieces. All right, here's my super duper staircase up to the back here. Um, yes, these have to come off. They look terrible. Right, we will replace them in here, maybe. Let's see what this looks like. We just indent them like this. Yes, and also I'm testing out which windows look better. And I think these, actually. When I get Optify and back, these will all be joined together anyway. They'll just be one thing, but I think I'm going to put the plain glass in here, actually. I normally go for this white stained glass, but I think I'm going to go for that right now. I think that's just going to look that little bit more realistic here. Okay, that might look pretty cool. Um, then we can take out a few things like this and put in some of these. Like that. Um, yeah, maybe maybe another one just there for now. Okay, let's go check what that looks like. What is that looking like from down here? Yep, yep, yep. I like that a lot. Um, I don't like that one there, but apart from that, that's looking really cool, guys. Okay, good. Um, I'm, what I'm going to do is try finish off the facade of this building and then start the next one so we can get more of an idea. And then I'll complete off the other ones. And we're not just going to do green. We'll do this building out of completely different materials. And yeah, we might use wool of different colors like red and yellow to make it like look, look like a little stall or stand outside or something like that. I'll figure that out. But let's, uh, let's finish off this one for now, I think, and see what happens. Anyone... Notice a, a problem with this roof that I've, I've just started constructing? Anyone? Anyone see it? What, what, what is the problem with this? It's, uh, it, it's, it's definitely on the wrong side of the building. Yep. What am I doing? Why am I building it out this way? Nobody knows. What? It, yeah, the cat agrees, where, wherever that cat is. Yes, I agree. It's rubbish. Alrighty guys, this one is now pretty much done. Obviously the side's not done, but uh, the roof is on. You can kind of see it. I will, uh, obviously, I'm going to fix, fix up the sides. There'll be some chimneys and stuff on there. Um, kind of like this one where you have like a different thing on the side there. Yep, yep. The cats and the, the birds are still cheering me on and insulting me at the same time when I mess up the roof. Um, anyways, guys, we got a few more little fronts to shops. I completely decided not to speak then. Uh, we should be able to fit through here. This is just holding up this here, but I think I'm going to change that. Yeah, I don't really like that. I'm going to change that. I don't like those trapdoors there at all. Um, we could even have that taken out completely and like have a block there and then have just this block at this height here. Yeah, I think I might do that, take that one out and then have the trapdoors underneath this one. Um, that's going to be difficult to do right now because those are going to fall down. If we just take these out quickly, we might be able to do it. Let's see, get the trapdoors. Um, I might get the spruce trapdoors as well, but then we can go like that. Yeah, okay, that looks 10 times better. 10 times better. In fact, you can even put these there. Um, let me just get some spruce ones really quickly. Alrighty, spruce trapdoors in hand. I think if we place these here, 
put them down. But I'll still hold these. And yeah, it looks a lot better. So if this is closed, yeah, that looks pretty good. Okay, cool. Uh, that's another front shop here. We have this like little hangover with the red and the yellow. The red is a little bit too much. I might try to change that up for another color or a different material. Um, and on this one, we just have this running across. And yeah, we're going to have the bricks going up there. We might have some small windows like on this side. These are two by two windows. I'm not sure what we can fit in there, to be honest. Oh, these do run up next to those bricks there and they look just fine. So we might copy a bit of this design over to here. Uh, so that'd look cool. All right, guys, um, let's fly up so we can see this big building here. See what that looks like. I think that's going to look really cool. Yeah, that is that is awesome. I really do like that. Um, the only thing I'm going to do is try taking these side bits off. These two pieces of dark prismarine. I think those could come off. I think that would uh, that would improve that muchly. The silly little detail, and I don't think it looks very good. Oh yes, okay. Funnily enough, that has improved it a lot. Okay, cool. I really like this design, guys. Let me get the, the two facades of these two in, and we should be on a pretty good roll here. Alrighty, guys, I'm, I'm gonna be honest. This one on the left-hand side here, I just straight up copied. I, I went into that world, and I really liked that building, so I've added nothing to it. I just completely copied it. That's okay, as long as you acknowledge that and don't pretend that it's yours. That's, it's not cool to do that when people do that. I've had people completely re-upload my video just as it was and pretend it was theirs. And on Instagram, people just post my pictures and say, I built this. No, you didn't. I did. But, you know. Anyways, guys. Yeah, so that end building there is looking pretty cool. I've done a bit of work on here, and I'm going to work on this one now. Um, so the road over here is... It's going to carry on like this. I'm not sure. this This style here was like, this is more of a walking path style. I don't know why, but I made all of this like that, thinking it looked cool as a road, but it didn't. So I'm going to take out all of these blocks. And so the footpath's just going to loop around here, and there's going to be a, a brick building here. And then the road goes off in this direction behind the bank here. And this bank is getting renovated soon, guys. All of the sandstone is getting changed out for quartz, probably. So um, one day I'm going to have to sit there and uh, trade a lot of quartz blocks just so we can... Uh, fix this. I think it'll look much nicer if I make it look more like marble-like. Anyways, that aside, guys, we, we have this building in now, which looks really cool. And I'm going to attach it to like a corner building here. And then, yeah, let's finish off these couple down the end here. And I'm also going to rip out all of these blocks to make this road look a lot better. Probably just two over there somewhere. And then we'll uh, we'll continue it and connect it to the road that goes to the university over there eventually. But anyways, guys, let's crack on with these buildings. I think they're looking pretty damn fancy. And I'm liking them a lot. Okay, let's uh, let's get these shops and things in down here. Okay guys, these two are now finished and I really like how this one like sticks up like quite a bit further in the middle here. These stupid cats. You shut up. I mean, I bet the birds are probably copying them as well. But anyways, yeah, I like how this shoots up in the middle here and like stands out a bit from these buildings. I think that looks really cool. I've got that bit in the middle there. Yeah, all these roofs are sort of coming together now. Um, I decided to switch it up and put uh, gray wool on the end. And on this side, I think I'm going to do the roof out of brick on this uh, corner building. But yeah, let's just quickly fly past. Well, yeah, let's try and do that a bit slower, maybe. Yeah, there we go. We can see. Oh, I've I've, uh, I've uh, missed out some glass. How did I not notice that? I've been up here to put these in and all sorts of things. Okay, well, that's just full of blocks of glass back there because I wanted these little details here. So yeah, it's a bit like that one, which is pretty much the same. It's got um, a full glass block. Those might even be windows but um, i'm not sure but anyways guys yeah we got all of that um i decided i'm going to space these out a little bit further as well um it's not going to be super even as well but it's going to be uh, uh i think what we do is we have them one out from those and then a block of two space of two but that's not going to line up with the lights that are already here well it does on this one somehow i Okay, well it doesn't on these anyway, so you have this one like close and at that end it's two away and all sorts of things. But I think a bit of randomness will do this street a lot of good. And uh, having back walls on these might do a lot of good as well. Alright guys, I think it's time to work on this end house. So, what do I need? I need quartz. I'm going to build this out of quartz and brick again. Um, so, oh, I think there was some in there. Get some of these quartz pillars. These are an absolute mess by the ways. By the ways, guys, let's pull that out of there. We need all of this stuff here. Um, I'm going to have to go do some more trading, I think. Oh, bone blocks. Could we use them anywhere? Maybe. But anyways, guys, I think this corner here is... Yeah, we're going to need a lot of bricks, I think. So I think we do have enough bricks. But um, yeah, I think I'm going to do the roof like sort of a curved roof 
with stairs, with stair blocks that are the, the bricks. Yeah, I think that'll look really cool. Alrighty, let me let me work on this corner house here. Hmm, what can we do here? I'm not too sure. I think that's about the size of it. It's not going to be too big. But yeah, that's nice. Let's get this corner uh, house slash shop in. Alrighty guys, most of this corner building is now finished. So yeah, it's looking pretty cool. Ignore the nether portal in there. But yeah, that's uh, going up there. We have like a little walkway in here on the corner. I actually widened this because I couldn't have like these or anything when it was just too wide. So it's now one, two, three, four in that gap there. So we have a two gap here um, and we wouldn't have had these and it just would it just wasn't looking right guys. So we've widened that. We now have these little things going up there. We have like a bit of a trim going around there and then just not full trim on the next level, just like a few pieces. Uh, but now guys, what I want to do is work on this roof. So... I think this is going to be the hardest part here, but you know what? The shape is looking phenomenal. I'm really, really liking this. Holy heck. Did we just bounce off that? I don't know what just happened. Come on, Minecraft. Let's let's play the game. Let's play the game. Let me land properly. You know, I'll just land on this roof. That'll make it easier. All right, let's uh, jump down here. So what I want to do is actually fill in this gap here, 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 and up there as well, because otherwise that looks a bit silly. Um, what we're going to do is put stone in there, I think, like that. That will give us a place to plant this. And then I think what I'm going to do for now is just follow this pattern around. And if the roof starts to look stupid, I'll fix it. But I think if we just follow this roof around, hmm, we've got to make sure we place things correctly. Lower half of the block. There we go. Fantastic. Um, yeah, I'm going to follow this around like so. So give me a second. I just want to see what a few levels of this look like. All right, that's three layers, guys. So then the next layer is going to be here, right there, like so. So I'm wondering what this is going to look like from down below. I'm just going to build this little corner here, right to there. Now, right, let's go see if that is looking nice or not. Is it looking good? You know what? I like that. That is pretty cool. That's pretty much what I was going for. Just like a bit of a rounded roof there at the top. Um, yeah, no, that is nice, and that's going to blend right into that building. It's going to go up probably a bit higher. Maybe we put, like, a little tower on here or something. I'll figure that out once I get up there. Okay, cool. This this whole street is coming together. Um, I think I'm definitely going to have to clear out the back and put the backs of the buildings on. Um, they won't have any detail. They'll just be flat, probably. But, um, yeah, they're, they're right now they're, they're looking rubbish because you can see right through them. I think it would get a lot better atmosphere if we put those backs on. So let me just finish this roof and we'll see what that's looking like first. All right, guys, we made it into a chimney up the top here and put flower pots on top for that. So that is awesome. We can't get smoke out of there because this is like one wide. So we can't put like the things right here or anything like that. Oh, no. Now where's that brick gone? All of these blocks are so special. I need to look after them all. Come back. Okay, got it. Um, yeah, okay, so this roof's a little funny, guys. It comes up the middle here and then eventually we get to this point where we have to put in these. So I put in slabs. Slab there, slab up to there, and obviously this is not in the middle, and that's going to annoy some people, but buildings are not built um, like this. They're just uh, sort of things to put where they can go, so yeah, they, they weren't building it in with that in mind. Um, I think we could probably put in some stairs here, maybe. Uh, fill that gap in there. That Will that fix that? No, it's not amazing, guys, but like I said, buildings were not built like that, so... Um, the fact that it's a little bit different is actually really cool because, you know, a lot of these buildings have like perfect roofs and things, but yeah, no, that is cool. That is a really, really nice building. I really like that building right on the end there. That just rounds it off perfectly. Alrighty, guys, we need to build the backs of these buildings. Oh, this street. I am loving this street now. We need to put the backs on these buildings so that we can't see through them into like the grass and things like that. Man, I just looked at my shovel. It is almost gone, but I'm going to dig out this grass hump of rubbishness here. And uh, yeah, hopefully we will have uh, everything we want. Now, I, did, I didn't measure this, but these houses with a three with a five wide roof there um, come right back to like this block here and some of them this block here because they're different sizes. They jet in and out. I think one, maybe that one's going to come in line with this, but we'll just build it from there out. Or we might even put it right into take out the fence and put it in there because that'll look cool as well all right what i'm going to do is cut off this hill down here get rid of this we're actually digging into this area here which is like the top of the old villager spawning place uh trading hall that's right we'll dig all this out because it's just in the way and we don't use it anymore because all the mechanics change it's these chests rubbish i'm breaking one dried kelp i mean i'll take that the rest can just go i think 
Anything in here? Potatoes, we got lots of that. Uh, we do need stone. Okay, I'll, I'll come grab a few of these things. I think most of this is just going to go to waste. Alright, anyways, let's dig out this big hole, and hopefully I don't have to repair my shovel. Um, I might go repair it just to be safe, guys, because I don't want to break it. I really don't want to break it. Alrighty guys, these are the final blocks of today. I hope I don't notice anything else because I was just about to record and then I noticed these weren't filled in. This is the final blocks just over here. We might want to add detail into this later on, but there we go. Alright, let's fly down here guys, and that is the corner of this building on this side. And as you can see, you can run back here. There's going to be a gap now, and then we'll have some more buildings in here. Do we have any of this on us? No, I wanted to fill that in. Um, yeah, we're going to have a gap of these two blocks and then another building here. This is like a little path to get back to the park here, which is awesome. Uh, this is the back now, guys. I filled in all of the backs of these buildings. So if we take a fly up here over towards the front of the cathedral, just pretend there's a whole cathedral there. And yeah, I filled in a lot of windows and stuff. I actually put in a lot of details. So it's been like two, two and a half, maybe three hours. Yeah, that sounds like a long time, but uh, I filled these all in now, guys. So yeah, you can see through the windows on the other side. So obviously we need to do the interiors of these for it to look super real. And they need walls in between them as well, which would help. But uh, yeah, we have done so much work today. The only thing that isn't done is those blocks there because I'm not sure if I'm going to stick another house right there, like attached to it, or if we're going to leave a gap and then put some more houses and buildings around here. I'm not too sure. Um, but anyways, guys, that is what it looks like from the park side. So we'll just fly down past through the park here and take a look. I think that looks really nice now. And the park seems to be coming more into its own. It seems like more in place now that these are here. So yeah, those are all in. It's only the second floor windows are in. All of the first floor is all just boarded up. Uh, we'll probably have some doors and stuff going um, out there to like the very small space that everyone has back here. They're like little backyards and things. They're all shops down the bottom, so... They'll have like, uh, yeah, their little things. Anyway, those are uh, that this this street, guys, is looking fantastic. It's finished, and I am absolutely so pleased with this. This is one of my favorite things I've ever built. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the like button and uh, subscribe if you haven't already, because there is more awesome content on the channel and a lot more awesome videos coming for 2020. So, anyways, guys, I will see you on the very next episode. <laughs>